Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu It's been quite some time since I made a video where you could hear me saying something Okay So as you can see this, this is my Ubuntu 9.10 desktop And I'm at my login screen GDM And as you can see the background over here, I've got a custom background And I'll show you how to apply a custom background to your desktop Alright I'll just log in and can you see the animation over here? Okay, I've got a colorful Ubuntu logo and a colorful animation. Yes, so you can do whatever you want. I'll show you how to do that. All right. Can you see this clearly? Yeah. So uh, I'll continue this uh, on my next stop. See you there. So anyways, I'm back over here. So uh, let me show you. All you gotta do is type gk sudo space nautilus on your terminal window and we're gonna open the file browser with root privileges uh, okay so here it is and let's browse to splash folder user okay slash user slash share slash images slash splash alright once you go there you'll find these images backgrounds with different resolution this one is 800 into 600 and so on and so forth all right so if you've got a high resolution screen so you have to check sure that you're using these backgrounds if you're using a like if your desktop is at lower resolution then you gotta edit change you know replace this uh, wallpaper with any wallpaper you have so I uh, created this uh, with GIMP all right and then I replace it over here and as far as the logo is concerned my uh, desktop resolution uh, this logo was fitting in my GDM and this throwbar image uh, this has to be in PNG format and the background has to be in JPG format right as you can see this is the default um, throwbar and uh, logo image while this is the one that I created with GIMP as you can see this this one and this one so uh, I replaced it with this you can create a backup backup uh, directory because if uh, you want to updates your xsplash it will uh, it will replace these files so just keep a backup Be keep a backup of your original files and this custom backgrounds if you want okay and okay when you're done with that you gotta type another thing which I'm gonna post in my description box as usual uh, that's this command as you can see over here gk sudo space hyphen u space gdm hyphen deepest hyphen launch genome hyphen appearance hyphen properties press enter and that's gonna get you a different appearance preferences uh, window so this is not this is not the one where you get by right clicking on desktop and clicking on change desktop background that will be a different one while this will be a different one all right so when you go to background you gotta choose this you gotta choose any background that will be your background to your GDM uh, graphic display manager so that's it it's as simple as that you choose your GDM background and then you replace those uh, files as I was talking earlier and you log out you'll get a new background with new Proper image and name you want to logo. That's it. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu.